Now today we're going to find out whether or not a 2000 year old saying is in fact true. Ever hear the saying, red sky at morning, sailors take warning, red sky at night, sailors delight? We're going to take a closer look at that and see how much of that saying is actually true. Let's talk about why we can see a red sky at sunrise. Now that typically happens because if we have a cloud in the west, we have these particles in the atmosphere, that sunlight is going to scatter those blue and violet colors and we're going to reflect those red colors. That's the longer wavelength. So that's why we can see this red colors reaching our eyes at sunrise. And if we have those clouds or those storms in the west, we can typically assume that those storms are going to be approaching us at sunrise because those storms weather patterns do typically move from west to east. Now let's take a look at what happens at sunset. Let's go to Reed. All right, Christina, thanks for that great explanation for what happens at sunrise. We'll now talk about the sunset and obviously the sun sets in the west for us here and what's happening once again. Fairly similar to the sunrise is that the sun's rays are traveling through the thickest part of the atmosphere. So your blues, your violets, your green rays of light are scattered and reflected out and your yellows, your oranges, your reds continues to reach further out to the east. They're all coming in contact with clouds and that red is what's reflected back to you. So what does that mean for us here at sunset? Well, the weather in general moves from west to east for our weather patterns in our area. So that means that storms are pushing out of the region and more pleasant weather is expected to arrive. Now, as shown, this saying is mainly true, but more reliable, especially when those weather systems, those winds are moving from west to east. Thanks everybody for watching. If you have any questions about what we just talked about or any other weather phenomena, feel free to reach out to us, whether it's on social media or send us an email. And who knows, maybe next week we'll be talking about that. Thanks for watching, guys.